Hi everyone, welcome back to Tragic MTG, and today I've got uh, one of each color of the uh, theme booster packs. Uh, I bought a big bundle from on the internet, and uh, this was part of it, um, so I'm just going to check them out. Uh, let's go. These are pretty known to be like kind of iffy on like value, right, because they're like retail, they're like $7.99 or something like that. In here you get like 35 cards specific wow you had to like destroy this package just to even get into it ah, i see it's like at the bottom um yeah it's like eight bucks to get pretty much you know, it's all of one color basically so this was the white pack yeah wow they make it hard so you can't uh, steal it and repackage it which i'm a fan of um making it hard for that to happen i've seen at the like target and walmart where people have repacked um commander box the boxes and uh put like a uncommon in the, the front so you someone who didn't know would would easily uh, be fooled by that anyway let's go through these and see if we got anything so a lot of commons to and and uncommons there's no like i don't think specific order you got a some constellation um mostly uncommon i don't think there's any common constellation stuff maybe i'm wrong uh, duplicate Omen of the Sun. Sure, you could totally build your white deck out of this. Um, definitely kind of like a starter level product here. Um, anyone who's opening up a bunch of boxes is going to get plenty of comms and uncoms to work with. You don't really need to go out of your way to find these kind of things. Um, definitely from the retail end, this is where the target audience is. Um, but oh yeah, three Omen of the Suns now. And uh, hopefully get to the rares. I think you get at least two in this, I sure hope. Um, and maybe, if we're lucky, a mythic. They must be all the way at the end. These, There's one rare card. It's an idyllic tutor. So it's a good rare, for sure. Um, but uh, for eight bucks, I would really be much more thrilled to at least get two rares like guaranteed in this pack so that was that there's the white one right there um and, a, and an advertisement to play arena online sure let's see if i can open this from the other side and yeah they've got it nice and glued up there the uh the packages are even bigger like that takes up more room on the the pegboard at your local giant store I wonder if they're are they into that or not I don't know blue now and commons and uncommons you know them you love them got a lionfish and a sad reflection guy and are we going to get a constellation an unknown shore has got to have that in every pack, right? So you can uh, filter your mana. Ichthyomorphosis, the crazy fish guy. Shoal Kraken. There's a nice saga, at least. Eidolon. Starlet Mail coming down to the end. Looks like we're going to get one rare again. Yep, Glimpse of Freedom and a Thassa's Oracle. That is the blue rare here. It's a good card, sure. 1-3 Merfolk Wizard that does some stuff. There it is. Wow. Yeah, so... <clears throat> this is kind of an is it worth it kind of video right here. And already I can tell you no. It's not... I would not recommend this to... Really anybody. Um, even a new player. I would tell them maybe get a Planeswalker deck or something like that. Which I'll probably... That was part of my bundle too. Oh yeah, don't steal. You're going to get busted anyway. Um, yeah, the part of this whole bundle that I got was, uh, the Planeswalker deck, so I'll be going through those as well. Black, now, the Fruit of Tizerus. Yuck, who wants that? Gray Merchant of Asphodel, we'll pull that at least. Agonizing Remorse is a, yeah, it's that way. Black has got some good, uh, commons and uncommons at least. Timurit. Yep, yep, yep. 
one. Yep, there's another Gary. And an Underworld Sentinel is the rare. Guess I haven't seen this. Four or five Skeleton Soldier, soldier for five. And when it attacks, you exile a target creature card from your graveyard to no benefit. And when it dies, put all cards exiled with it onto the battlefield. There's your benefit. Sorry. Okay. I'll continue reading the card, and then we'll know if it's any good or not. So, it's all right. Um, whoop. Green. Yeah. One rare for each of these packs. It's like, not cool. I'm just going to say it. One one death touch state uh, snake for one is uh, that's decent. I would play that card. Saga. Horn beetle. I like that card. And nothing really too amazing in there, of course. Destiny Spinner's fun. I like that card. And I got a Nessian Boar. It's a 10-6, not Trampler. It's a 5-drop Boar. And it does all that stuff. You can read it. There you go. All right. And now the red one. Yep. Yep. Luckily, I got a bit of a discount on these. So, glad I didn't pay full price. Should definitely let these sit on the shelf at the store. All right, unknown shores. They gotta get them out there somehow. We're gonna make you have it. There's a duplicate Scophos Maze Warden altar. There must have been one of those in each of the packs as well. I think I missed. Thrill of possibility. Here we go. What do I get? I get Phoenix of Ash. Two, two for three. Flying haste. You pay to give it plus two, and you can escape it by exiling three other cards and paying for it. And it escapes with a one-one counter on it. Boo! <laughs> Nothing really good there. So anyway, that's the theme boost booster packs, right? Um, don't recommend. Um, just had to try them. They were part of the bundle, so why not make a video? There it is. Thanks for watching. Tragic out.